Welcome to the second edition. Welcome to the uh, second uh, episode of Today in History on my new YouTube channel, The Life of John T. Weibel. I am John T. Weibel, and uh, hope everybody's having a good day. Um, Sorry if I seem a little tired. I literally just woke up like half an hour ago. Uh, so, oh, and uh, hope uh, many of you are having a good day. It's, uh, it's raining outside, so I figure I'm going to be stuck inside for most of the day. But I'll try to have fun. But I hope everybody is enjoying their summer so far. It's the second day of summer. And, uh, and here we go with today in history. Uh, today is, uh, June 22nd, 2021. And we have some very famous events that occurred today in history. First off, in 1906, uh, President, Teddy, President Theodore Roosevelt sued John D. Rockefeller. He sued the Standard Oil Company as they operated a monopoly. Uh, French surrender. On June 22, 1939, eight days after German troops entered Paris, the French formally surrendered to Germany. President Pétain's request for an armistice was transmitted to, Hitler, to Adolf Hitler on the night of June 16th. Hitler's terms were delivered to the French envoys two days later. Talks between the two countries took place while German troops continued to advance through the Lourdes. On June 22nd, however, the French bowed their heads and accepted all of Hitler's terms. The bitter event took place in Marshall or Fox, Fox Old Railway a carriage in the forest of Compiègne. The same used by the French to humiliate the Germans when they accepted their surrender in 1918. Uh, also today in 1941 France accepts the armistice terms of Germany and Italy. That was 1940. 1941, Germany invades the USSR, which is no longer around. Excuse me. Also today, in 1969, uh, actress Judy Garland was found dead. Ed. Uh, and, uh, she was an actress who acted this, and she co-starred in a few movies with Mickey Rooney. And you also might recognize her for the role of Dorothy in the movie The Wizard of Oz. Uh, she died at the age of 47 uh, due to an overdose, due to a drug overdose. And we also have a few birthdays today. Uh, first off, we have George Vancouver, who was born in 1757. He was an explorer, and as you and as you might guess, his surname was where the Vancouver Islands and Vancouver in Canada got its name. Uh, next, we have Billy Wilder, who was born in 1906. He was born in Austria, and he was a film director, and also a writer, or who directed and wrote many hit movies, such as Sunset Boulevard. Uh, we also have uh, uh, we also have Chris Christopherson, and uh, who is eighty-five today. A, a singer, songwriter, and an actor. And I believe his first wife was Rita Coolidge. And 
and him and Rita Coolidge first made uh, they made an appearance on the Muppet Show in I believe it was 1978. Uh, another birthday today is Meryl Streep, who is 72 today. Okay, she's an actress. Uh, this and she starred in many films. Uh, such as The French Lieutenant's Wim Woman. And another and uh, another birthday today is Eric Green. In Eric Green was is a former NFL tight end. And he was born in 1967 and he's also still alive. So he is 54 today. Uh, he form, uh, formerly played for the Pittsburgh uh, for the Pittsburgh Steelers and was one of the original tight ends for the Baltimore Ravens. Uh, and and of course with the Ravens he played against his former team the Steelers a few times and with the Ravens he actually beat the Steelers in week 14 of their inaugural season a 31 to 17 win over the Steelers. There's at Memorial Stadium, which was the Ravens' original home until they moved into Ravens Stadium in 1998. Well, that's about it for today in history. Uh, hope you all uh, enjoy these videos. Those, uh, those. Hope you try to have a good day in spite of the rain. Uh, do something productive, do something fun. Uh, I'll see you all uh, next time. I'm, uh, I won't do on this day every single day. I will do it most days. I'll usually try to post videos probably one or two days a week. But this is something that I will enjoy and I, I hope you guys will as well. Uh, and remember to like, comment, and subscribe to this channel, and I'll see you next time.